Welcome to my tutorial. I said in the last tutorial that that, that tutorial um, would be the, the last tutorial in CSS, but there's something else I want to show you. So let's dive right in. T today I want to talk about styling using spans, which is styling um, basically in the div. What if I wanted to style a part of a paragraph tag? So let's say I've got a P here and I want it to say this text will be read. And this will be blue. So there we have it. Now we know a div is a HTML element, so if I say a spans like a div, then we must be using the same me methodology. What we're going to do is we're going to as this text or is read as the first part, we're not going to put that in the span, but we're going to put so this will be blue text in the span. So we're just going to do an opening tag in our paragraph tag which says span and then obviously we're going to close the tag around it. So, how do we style this, you ask? Well, in the same way as we style a div, in the first part we put ID. We'll be going over class later, by the way. Um, so we're just going to give this an ID of blue. just to keep things uh, nice and simple. So now let's go over into our CSS, which you notice is already linked up in our head. And we're just gonna type some uh, simple code to make this happen. We're gonna type a hash shine to reference the div, which is that. And then we're gonna type the name of our span, but it's still the same hash sign because every time you use a id attribute that's what the, the, the things in the um yellow text are called every time you use an attribute of an id and then you give it a name you have to use a hash sign so we've got hash sign and then we need to put the name of the spam we want to style so the one we want to style is blue. And then I'm just going to put a background of blue in there. And just to show you that um, it's not just there, I'm going to do paragraph um, styling and then I'm going to put the rest of the paragraph as red.
pre preview that and we see that the um the main of the text is red but because we've wrapped that text in the span that text and only that text is styled it's not a part of a b box so this was just a quick tutorial on span text i hope it's helped you please subscribe if it has thanks for watching